This exercise is called the seated dumbbell military press, for obvious reasons. I'm sitting down and I'm using dumbbells. This is a uh, it's kind of like an accessory exercise to the normal military press with the barbells. With the exception, this is called a unilateral exercise. Unilateral simply means one side or the other, or they're not tied together with the bar. The reason that you're doing this in a seated position is it eliminates what we call the body English, which means you're not able to use your legs, you're not able to use your calves, your thighs, your ankles, anything to help move that weight up. It's just flat. You're on your butt, you're moving the weight up. So there's going to be a little bit of swaying here, <clears throat> but you're going to try and control that to, the, uh, to a large extent. So let me demonstrate here. Take the dumbbell in hand. This is a neutral grip. Again, I'm in favor of the neutral grip. Most sports are conducted in a neutral grip. You are not out mowing the lawn with our hands in this position right here, pushing a little lower. We're moving some weights. And in order to move weights, to get a good transfer over to the playing field, kind of assume the same positions. In fact, the closer you can get to the joint angles and the speed and the velocity of your sport while you're lifting, the better that transference is going to be to the playing field. So, having said that, let me demonstrate. Dumbbell military press. Straight up, straight down. Straight up, straight down. Straight up, straight down. I'm going to show it to you from the side. And notice when I'm on the side like this, if I happen to lose my balance backwards, it's going to be a real difficult task to pull this thing back together without uh, a potential injury. So, I want my trainees and the athletes to come into my gym to be straddling this bench. We don't do a whole lot of seated anything. You know, I want them standing up, doing an exercise of standing up. However, if they've got a knee problem or they've got something wrong with their lower body, this is a pretty fair uh, substitute for the standing military presses. All right, watch. Straight up and down. That's the seated military press. That's how I expect it to be done. And if you do it that way, you're going to be safe, you're going to uh, be able to live strong, and you're not going to end up injuring yourself.